Hi, hello, this is Mark. This is um, 4 a.m. in Thailand. I did not sleep. I've been working around the clock uh, in solve some problem and do some research about the lion. And um, I found some tips that might be useful. After you have successfully downloaded the uh, Mac OS X Lion to your computer, the file is about one, about four gigabytes, I think. Before you proceed with the installation procedure, please, after you have successfully downloaded that that Lion, please kindly check in your application folder. You will see an application called Mac OS 10 Lion Installations app or something. Um, you have to back this up. Okay, to a hard drive or anything to because if you don't back this up after you have finished installing this thing, the Lion on your Mac, and if any problems occur, you have to download that things again. Okay, so after you have successfully downloaded the Lion OS to your computer, it's four gigabyte. You check. Okay, don't don't proceed. Just check in the application folders on your computer on your Mac. And you, and you will find a file, it's called um, Mac OS 10 installer app or something, Lion, whatever. So you have to back this up. And um, actually, you don't really need to do it. There is another way. If you have successfully um, installed this Lion on your computers and you want to be able to reinstall the OS, you can just turn your Mac on and you have to hold down the option key. Pretty much like when you were doing this when you want to choose between Macs and Windows and Bootcamp, but this time you hold out option keys and then uh, it, it appears on the screen. Um, two hard drive will appear on the screen. You see one um, regular Mac hard drive, another one is called recovery drive. So that's the second um, solutions and the last solution, people ask me a lot about how to create uh, a backup DVD and this one can be contributed to other or it can make a backup thumb drive. So how can we do that? It's very easy. Uh, after you have successfully copied that um, Mac OS X Lion installer app from your application folder, you can just do the right clicks on that one on, on these files and it appears on the screen is called show package content okay inside the show package content there is um, a sub file is called um, installer esd dot dmg so you have to just move this to any like for instance like the freeware called burns go to the copies and then you can burn a DVD for the line. I'm sorry, like I got nothing to show to you right now because I I don't really like the line very much, so I have not yet uh, installed the things. Okay, so um, if you don't understand what I was saying, you can just you know go back to the beginnings or send me any comment. Okay, it's like for this issue, it's like reading the Lord of the Rings. Okay. I got the lot of the ring right here that I, I read every day. <laughs> so it, so you have to use your imagination, but I promise you that the things that I told you here today, it worked. Thank you.